Uh, got my pitch count up. Uh, you know, uh, felt all right. Uh, no issues um, uh, with uh, where I was injured. So uh, obviously would have liked to have been more consistent uh, in the strike zone. But, um, you know, overall, I think the, the bottom line is uh, being healthy. And uh, I felt healthy. You anticipate having another rehab, sir? Uh, I don't know. I, I, I mean, obviously, this, this, whole, this whole time, we've kind of gone uh, step by step, day by day. So I think the first thing is to see how I respond uh, after pitching today and uh, how I feel the next couple of days. It's been the hardest part of the process, having you know, got to have some patience with this, but yeah. just trying to go through the motions step by step. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess the hardest part is not being out there with my teammates. Um, you know, uh, you know, the competitive side, you want to be out there and uh, be able to help in any way you can. So uh, that's definitely been the hardest part so far. This is a city and state that doesn't have a major league baseball team, but a lot of Tigers fans out there gave you a standing ovation and came off the field. What was that like? For you? Yeah, that was great. You know, uh, obviously, it's not too far uh, from Detroit, and I think a bunch of people made the trip. so. Um, you know, it's, it's always nice to have Detroit fans. We, we always travel well no matter what city we're in, and uh, to have them uh, uh, cheer for me was, uh, was a very nice touch. Health-wise, do you feel like you're ready to return to the big leagues? Yeah, I feel good. Um, you know, uh, like I said, no, no issues um, uh, in regards to, to the injury, so um, that's obviously, I think, the, the most important thing uh, coming away from today. Trying to command the zone, how did it feel for you? Uh, inconsistent. Um, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't uh, quite as good as I would like, uh, obviously, but, um, you know, I, a lot of 3-2 counts, um, you know, just some extra pitches that uh, were unnecessary, but, uh, you know, that, that usually comes pretty quickly. On one of the walks you were ahead of uh, 2 was it hard to get a good feel? Um, you know, like I said, inconsistency, uh, that's uh, one of the, one example. Uh, there's, there's a few of them today, um, you know, just uh, wasn't able to quite uh, execute the, the pitch to put the guy away. Uh, you know, I think it was just more mechanical, um, you know, which which would say all my pitches, um, you know, just the inconsistencies throughout the mechanics uh, don't really allow you to repeat as well as you'd like. Uh, I think a lot of that comes from just being the first time in the game and, uh, you know, first time really, uh, really amping it up. Was it nice to be in real situations today, despite maybe not one situations you wanted to be in, but at least not be a simulated game of bullpen pitching? Yeah, you know, obviously it's uh, it's a little bit different. Um, you know, with another team in the batter's box and uh, and not pitch against your own guys. So yes, it was it was good to be in that situation. The, I know it's minor park, but it had you at 96. Is that what you think, or is that what what it felt like, or can sure? You tell? Yeah, you know, it's hard for me to tell. Uh, you know, I'm just going off of that. So I mean, that seems about right, I guess. What's it like to be thrown on a team <laughs> where you don't know anybody, or I know a few of the guys, you know, from spring training. Uh, you know, some guy came in here and knew nobody. Um, so uh, it wasn't too difficult. Uh, you never made a Triple A start, you know, coming up you know, through the minor leagues, and obviously this wasn't the way you wanted to make a Triple A start. But what's what's it like, kind of just you know, being a Triple A for two days? Uh, uh, Overall, you know, like you said, I skipped Triple A. Uh, <clears throat> you know, so I guess now I got all my bases covered. <laughs> um, you know, hopefully, uh, you know, hopefully it doesn't doesn't happen again. Now, obviously, you never want to go on a rehab assignment. That means you got hurt. So, uh, you know, went ten years without doing it, and. You know, hopefully, be a long time since. Justin, did the uh, cold weather have any effect getting loose early? No, not really. It wasn't too cold. You know, uh, uh, what is it, 60 degrees outside, something like that? That's not, you know, that's not. You start, you know, when you get down in the, you know, low 50s, high 40s, that that has a uh, an impact. But today wasn't not really. I got a decent sweat going. Russ here in Indy. What do you think of this ballpark? It's kind of a unique view downtown. Isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. Uh, I actually had a nice view of the ballpark from my hotel room. Uh, it's, a, it's a beautiful place. Uh, I'd heard a lot of great things. I've never been to Indy. Uh, you know, I guess I can check it off now. It was nice to be here. Uh, were you able to convince uh, Wyrm 35 that it was an easy sell? I mean, I know early on there was 35 out there. Uh, yeah, it was an easy sell. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.